Hey students, welcome to EE Awesome. I'm Rudy Schlaf, a professor at the Electrical Engineering Department at USF. Today I'm going to show you how to hook up a breadboard to an Arduino and how to use that to drive an LED. So let's do it! Okay, here we have the breadboard. So if you want to connect a breadboard to the Arduino, a good idea is to connect the power rails first. And then you can use the power rails here to connect things that you are running on your breadboard. So when I say power rail, I'm talking about these contact points next to the red and the blue lines. And if this is the first time you're using a breadboard, um, all these contact points next to the red and the blue lines, they are interconnected. So what I can do now is to simply connect the one of the red contact points to the five volts pin of the Arduino and one of the blue contact points to the ground connector of the Arduino. And this gives us a 5 volt power rail. So we can use this power rail now to run the LED and this is the first time you work with LEDs. Um, you need to know that they are polar devices. So an LED has a positive and a negative end and that means it only lights up if you connect it with the right polarity. Now how do we know which one is the positive and the negative lead? Well one is longer than the other and the longer one is typically the positive one. The other thing you need to know about LEDs is that a red one needs about 2 volts to light up. And the Arduino puts out 5 volts so we need to drop this voltage before we can go into the LED and that we do with a resistor that we put in series with this LED. So if we want to hook up the LED, what we do first is to connect the resistor to the red power rail and then we put the other end of the resistor into one of those contact points in the center of the breadboard. Now in the center the contact points are connected together in groups of five horizontally. So if I want to connect now the LED to this lead of the resistor, very easily I can do that by putting the longer one, the positive end of the LED, in one of those contact points next to the resistor lead and then I put the other end of the LED into the negative power rail, the ground rail, the blue one. And so now we have a closed circuit, right? We come out here with 5 volts from the Arduino, we go into the red power rail, then we go into the resistor, but then uh, the current goes through the LED and it goes back through the ground rail into the Arduino board. So all we have to do now to light the LED up is to connect the Arduino board to the USB part of the computer and you see as soon as I puts the plug in, the LED lit up. Now the Arduino doesn't really participate here in this at this point because all we're doing is to use the Arduino board as a 5 volts regulated power supply to power our power rails and then we hooked up the LED to that. So in the next video I'm gonna show you how to make this LED blink by using one of the digital pins on the Arduino board and for that we will then have to write a little Arduino sketch and make the LED blink with that. So in the meantime, do something awesome with your Arduinos and I'll see you for the next EE Awesome video. Thanks for watching.